Well, this is a very good match to be complaining about bad refereeing, you know. Rather watch this great match. Fujimoto with, with uh, Nico. This is a good match. If Fujimoto wins this, he will become the champion of this tournament. After beating Matt Long and also beating Ceniceros from Mexico. Anyways, I mean, your attitude here is we're not here to argue, we're here to learn. And maybe that's what the Mexican players should learn, you know, never stop, never let go. Even if the referee says mate, don't stop. Because this may happen to you. And that's part of your experience. Fujimoto is a really smart player, controlling the sleeve at all times. Gets an invitation to go to Newaza, which he takes advantage of. But Nico controls both of his legs. Of course, I can't change anything no after talking to him, but if you have the video, I do want to see it. I have it. Right. Of course, okay. I do. Thank you. I do. We will show the video to the chief referee just to prove the fact that all of us saw, and you people on my Gerardo Padilla channel will be witness of the bad refereeing of today. Anyways, going back to this good judo match. Fujimoto is making sure he has the control of the sleeve for his beautiful Iponso Inage that gives him the gold medal in this tournament. Well executed, and, and that's what it is, you know, you cannot give him a chance because he'll take you. That's why he's so dangerous and so much fun to play against because you give up a little inch and you're going to get thrown by Ipon. Fujimoto from the East Bay Institute.